Right, let's get back into Chronicles by getting back into that sinking submarine, shall we? I feel a bit bad for um, having left this off at this point here. I mean, I kind of would have liked to have kept going and done this all as one chunk, if you get what I mean. But, um, yeah. I couldn't really record any more after what I was doing last session because uh, it was just getting so late, I was getting so tired, you know. Things would have gotten a bit dreary after that point, as I would have been kind of half asleep, if you get what I mean. What is that sound? God, it's a bit hard to see in this place. It's like the lighting is flashing on and off constantly. I kind of vaguely remember my way around here. I know there's a dead end in one direction, it would maybe pay to um, check that out before moving in the other direction. But which direction is that? Good question. Uh, maybe this way? Yes, does look like it. Wait, yep, no, I think so. Looks like it. Yep, there we go. Because that's another one of the um, airlocks by the looks of it. So where was the place where, um, is it Nikolai? Yeah, where Nikolai was. Do we have any flares left? No, we don't, unfortunately. So we're not going to be seeing things very well around here. For once, we need flares and we don't have any. Usually we have tons, we have gallons of the bloody things. Whoa, whoa, I didn't mean to just throw myself down there. That was a ladder I was supposed to have climbed down. Okay. If I just keep backing away, he won't bother getting his guns out. I'm right to think that, yeah. For the record, um, oh god, it's shaking. It's one of the hottest days that we've had in the UK today. It is boiling, oh shit. It is red hot today. Like, really, really hot. I'd be so much cooler if I had a fan on at the moment, but I'm being hardcore because I don't want you guys to hear any kind of background noise or anything like that. And, you know, I am... I'm sat here red hot at the moment, sweating my ass off, just so you guys can have a pristine, clear-sounding playthrough. Does that sound good? Am I being a Samaritan here? Am I being a good person? Am I dying for your sins? Probably. At least, um, yeah, hopefully this will come out a lot nicer than if I did have a, uh, a fan directed at the microphone. Alright, so let's climb up here. I can barely see. I can barely see at all. Like, it is so fucking dark in this place. Right, some lighting. Thank you. Okay, that's bad lighting. Don't want that lighting. Um... Can we get some, maybe, not-so-bad lighting? Like, not fire, maybe? I've probably got to do something with these keycard uh, slots, surely, right? Because we didn't really use those last time, did we? So what was that music about? There must be someone around here, right? No, it didn't send anyone after us at all. What was that all about, then? Right, um, let's get into this room and check around it. Hopefully we can find a key card or something. Otherwise, I think maybe we can climb back up through the vents just so we can avoid that fire over there. But I'll check in these drawers and that. I mean, someone might have been nice enough to place something into them since the, um, since the last session. I really doubt it, though, somehow. I mean, you know, who would do that? Oh, God. Yeah, it is... It has been such a hot weekend. I actually went out for once. Me, going out, that's pretty much unheard of. But yeah, I actually left my house for once and um, I got caught um, in a bunch of train delays and stuff like that just yesterday. I mean, it's the first time traveling on train in months and months and months and I end up, well, well the journey was supposed to be like two, two and a half hours and then I ended up um, traveling for about six hours nearly, I think. Oh God, that's collapsed, okay. Looks like we've got to go through the fire, unfortunately. Um, is there anything else we can do here? There must be some secrets in this level, right? I wonder how many. I mean, um... Is there any way we could... No? No, I did loot before, didn't I? Just before I turned off, right? I didn't just imagine that. Yeah, I think so. Um, right, okay, let's... Uh, let's go through the fire, I guess. Wait. What? Where, where's the fire? Oh, is it down the next route? It is, isn't it? Yeah, there it is. There's the fire. Right. 
by logic, if Laura sets on fire, we could just stand underneath one of these and she'll be put back out again, right? Or she could just lie down. I mean, we have the ability to lie down, don't we? Yep, we can just get in that water. Be perfectly fine. No fire anymore. But this is Tomb Raider, so I don't think that's going to be possible. So I'm going to save the game right there. And uh, then I'm going to hop over the fire. There we go. I did it. I'm so proud of myself. Are you proud of me? Of course you are. You're always proud of me, guys, aren't you? Right. It helps with my esteem. Okay, so maybe we can climb up there instead. But I'm going to check all these um, cabinets around the room again. Because, you know... Oh, wow. Look at that, Laura, on the floor right there. That, that, that might be useful for things, don't you think? That fire extinguisher? Hmm. You know... There's a fire out there, and there's a fire extinguisher sat right there. Oh, it's a good job I'm checking these. Okay, right, got my Uzis back, that's good. Probably will lose them soon since this is the, um, I believe, the last part of this segment. These segments are going by so fast, I think we're almost halfway through the game already. And there's only four in total. We have been to two so far, and, well, you know... Like I just said, I think this one's ending soon. Uh, is this another dead end? Yep, this is caved in as well. Now, how on earth has that happened? I don't remember the top of the submarine being crushed. Did I... Did I imagine that? Not happening? Did it actually happen? Uh, either way, it looks like we've got to confront the fire again, unfortunately. So let's walk back out there. Stare it deep in its eyes. Wait, mm. I'm gonna move a little bit this way first to kind of get the angling right, if you get what I mean. Just so I clear it properly. There we go. Nice. Huh? They're sentient! They were alive after all. Okay, right, so they're gonna electrify the water. Which means we've got to use the tables. They actually have a use now. Can I maybe walk to the... Well, I'm not going to attempt it, but I would assume that Laura would stop before actually, um, you know, walking into the water. That said, this is Tomb Raider, and by God, I am saying that a lot lately. Uh, I have learnt Tomb Raider well. Tomb Raider likes to fuck us over all the time, because Tomb Raider is good at that. Now, where on earth are we going? Um, we can't go in the kitchen, because... Yeah, there wasn't really a way we could... Oh, maybe we could, actually. I don't know. Either way, I think um, best bet is to just keep moving in this direction. If we hop over to this table... Oh, good God. Stop shaking, please. If we hop over to this table here... Um, yep, we can actually see into the kitchen. It looks like we can get into it. May as well give it a go, I guess. Uh, get the angling right. Uh, hmm. Hop in. Ah! Okay, right. She only gets electrified for a short... for as long as she stands in the water, so that's pretty cool, at least. Nope, there's more dangling wires there. Great. Okay. Well, I guess the hob has a use now. Oh. Well, that's a golden rose down there, isn't it? How the fuck do I get that? Can I maybe shoot them away? No. <laughs> I think I've got to just dip in there and get it, haven't I? That's... that's a bit of a bastard. Or maybe there's a way to turn it off. I should probably not try and just dive in there, I guess. Um, at least I know it's there. At least I know it's there. I mean, um... Kind of can work off of that, can't I? Uh... Maybe we can get the electricity turned off at some point? I assume that's the case. Oh fuck, oh fuck, oh fuck. I'm okay. I'm good. Laura's fine. She gets a buzz out of this. <laughs> uh, <laughs> yeah. It's the most electrifying adventure. Uh, I could say the reviews for this game were ecstatic. Uh, Let's, uh, let's get in here. Hopefully this, this little area here isn't electrified. It isn't. Okay. I thought I'd just put Laura in it. Test it out. You know. Ah, okay. Fucking hell. Stop that. Okay. 
God, that guy wasn't even doing anything wrong. Um, oh, fuck that. It's a bit late now, isn't it? If I see another guy, though, I'm gonna... G what was that jump about? If I see another guy, definitely gonna use a different weapon because uh, may as well use them. Oh, hello, card key. Looks like I'll be needing you. Oh, hello. I will use that. Thank you very much. By God, we do not have many medical supplies either. I actually like this. It's becoming a bit of a challenge, you know, but... Much unlike the rest of the Tomb Raider series. I- wait, hmm. I shouldn't say that, should I? Not after my experience with Tomb Raider 3, and 2, and 1, and 4, and 5. Yeah. Um, <laughs> let, let's hop up here, and let's see if there's anything, um... We can see from this angle, I really doubt it though, no. Uh, do we still have a crowbar, by the way? Oh, we do. We kept that in our suit all along, or left it there and came back for it, I don't know. Um... No, nothing there. I was kind of looking for boxes to kind of crack open and stuff like that. Oh, this is inside one of the card key areas. Okay, then. Uh, that's closed off. Now... Yeah, we can, um... <coughs> Excuse me, a bit of a cough there. Um, we can hop back, head in the direction we came from, and possibly use the card key on the door. Oh, fuck. Wow. I'm not doing a very good job of this, am I? I keep hitting my head on stuff. We'll, we'll go into the bathroom first, though. I imagine Laura needs to at this stage, having been through what she's been through. Uh, there's still nothing here, though. Bathroom still serves absolutely no purpose, it seems. Hmm. Okay. Well, okay, let's, let's keep heading back. I'm gonna make a save game here, just so that we can, um, you know, reload this if we need to, head into the kitchen, grab that golden rose, should we need to. Is it gonna be in a test of endurance? Is it gonna be like sore or something, you know? Oh, fucking hell. No, I'm not gonna save the game because I just fucking murdered Laura. Never mind, let's redo that, shall we? Well, okay, bye-bye camera angle, I guess. It decided to be submerged with her. Here lies the camera. Uh, right, okay, that's put me back here. That's not so bad. It is if I set myself on fire, though. There we go, get in the water, you're fine. Oh, God, it works. It fucking works. Holy shit. I, I... I've been mocking this game and all that, and it did actually work. God, I feel like a bad person now. I'm sorry, Core Design. Oh, for fuck's sake. Right, here we go. I finally semi-safely made it back. I only took a tiny bit of damage overall. I've actually saved some medikits as well, so that's good, and I... Wow. Mmm, you didn't see that. You know what? I said I saved a medikit. That never happened. I, I never saved a medikit. We still have the same number that we had last run. Okay, let's, um, let's not burn Laura to death now. Uh, where are we going? With the, 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 the door was right back at the beginning, wasn't it? Or near the beginning, anyway, I think. Uh, was it around here? I think we're going into the control room. I believe that's what we're doing. Uh, no, it's not here. It's in the other area, I think. Oh, no, it's right there. Okay, then. I don't know if there's a second door. I think the second door is the one that was already open. The one that we got the swipe card from, actually. Okay, so we can go in here. Oh, great. More. Hmm. We can climb up the ladder. Uh, we also can definitely not go this way because, you know, they're in the way. Uh, so let's go up the ladder because that's pretty much our only option at the moment. No, Laura, don't climb it like that. I don't like it when you do that. It takes a long time. We climb it properly, don't we, Laura? There we go. There's a good girl. Ladder. There we go. Right, now what? Okay, this is safe. But uh, have I been here before? Um, doesn't look familiar. A little bit of puzzleage here and there because it looks like a lot of, um... These little areas here. Oh, okay, we're safe here. Ah. This is, yeah, there we go. There's the ventilation system. This is where we were looking into before. At least I know for sure that one of the um, golden roses is probably going to be in this area. You know, the, now that we know that the, um, the first golden rose is actually in the kitchen. 
I don't know if we need to just kind of bear the electricity and go get that, because uh, at the moment I'm not seeing any way to turn it off. Though I kind of get the feeling that we definitely do need to turn it off, there's too many areas that are kind of, you know, in a state because of it, if you get what I mean. We can't actually access them properly, like we should be able to, right? Uh, or have I just finished the level? Oh, no. Who are you and what have you done with my Lara? To help my men. He babbles of the biblical spear, and I feed his madness for money to feed our families. And now, to this, corpses left for the fishes. Yarofem, I can help you, but you must help me. The ship is about to impact into the ocean bed, and then our time is up. We must hurry. <laughs> the escape pods have no internal air supply. <laughs> you will find the oxygen tanks in my stateroom. I hear my ship dying. <laughs> the internal seams are <laughs> splintering. <laughs> Aww. Well, Laura actually tried to help someone for once, and, well, he's not in a good state, is he? That's for sure. Okay, so what's this key? Uh, it's a silver key for whatever he said it was for, you know, I just... yeah. Okay, so, um, th there's a few places we can head back to, but let's try going up here first, shall we? I'll move over a little bit to the left and climb up properly. Kind of... I'm starting to worry that I am hitting towards the end of the level. They just seem to end so prematurely in this game, you know. Uh, what was this all about? Okay. Uh, is this just the top of the... What's this? Oh, do we need to put something in there? Maybe we do. I don't know. I could be wrong. I haven't seen any doors that need opening yet. I think this is just the um, the top of the submarine, actually. It, it looks to be the case. So, I don't think this actually serves any other purpose, or does it? I mean, this kind of stands out a bit. It looks like this can maybe be open, push, pulled, something like that, you know. I don't know. Right, um... Yeah, let, let's let's go back down. And let's start searching around in the, uh, the bottom area that we were before. I assume we can do something around here because there was a lot of places that we could still go into, like here for example. Um, no, we can't get in there, that's actually a, yeah, it doesn't have any way of getting into it full stop. Okay, um, well, let's try going the other way I guess, I think we've got to do a bit of platforming here in order to get over to there. Uh, where was it? Around here. Was it down there? No, I think it was on the left here. Is that right? Yep, there we go. No, it's left. Ha ha ha. Right. Uh, no left. I'm so funny today, aren't I? It looks like we're aiming to grab whatever the hell that is on the other side of the room. Like the yellow sort of... Oh, I'm guessing it's the oxygen, right. Because he was on about something to do with that. I'm seeing things dotted in the water here and there. Yeah, some bullets here. I don't know if there's been any bullets in previous segments of water. I apologize if I miss those. Uh, obviously, I wouldn't think to... Uh, oh, for fuck's sake, what am I doing? Sorry, I didn't do the jump. Um, I wouldn't think to actually get into the water to go get them, at least until the electricity's off, if it ever is turned off. I'm starting to have doubts now. Really starting to have doubts. What the fuck you... D Did she just climb back into the water after I kind of... Like, got a... Oh, whatever. Ah, uh, that's put me a fair bit back again. Uh, 
and we save the game because that's something I don't do very often in the right place. Okay, let's try this again. I think it would be best to approach it from this angle. Maybe not actually because of the low roof, but fuck it, so I'm just... Yeah, there we go. It's good enough. I think you're supposed to take a bit of damage, but just not too much, if you get what I mean. Uh, let's try this. Hey, we made it, right. Okay, pick that shit up. Thank you. So what's that? That that must be the oxygen tank, right? But it says N on it, isn't it? Yeah, nitrogen. Okay, um... There's more stuff on the floor. It's really tempting. I really want to dip my hand in there, but you know... I also, at the same time, don't want to be very, very electrocuted, if you get what I mean. Oh yeah, of course, we can do this little... Oh god. Uh, Alright, that, that, that was okay. Maybe I shouldn't be... Oh my god, there's a large first aid kit as well. This is really getting tempting. What do I do? Like, how the fuck do I get... Oh, for fuck's sake. I'm not very good at this gauging, like, when Laura's gonna die shit, am I? Oh, maybe making long jumps from corner to corner is a better idea. Oh, it might have well have been. Oh well. Uh. Oh fuck, oh fuck. <laughs> Definitely having second thoughts about that now, aren't I? Okay, let's, um... <laughs> Let's use a medikit. Wait a moment, when, since when did I have that many? I get, they keep getting- oh, for fuck's sake, what am I doing? Um, yeah, you didn't see that. You really didn't see that, did you guys? No, you did not. Do you want an X-Pass? Of course you do. Then, shh. Stay very quiet about it. Okay, good. We've come to an agreement. Where on earth are we going now, then? I mean, we've got the- got the nitrogen. I don't remember him saying that we needed nitrogen for whatever reason. Um... Maybe I've got to shove it on my ass, jump out the ship, and then, you know, there she goes. Uh, probably not the solution, though. No. Hmm. The only other way we can go is... What the fuck am I doing? Sorry, I'm very reckless today, apparently. Uh, we can go through... We can't really go through there at all, can we? No, we cannot. Let's not throw Laura in there. Yeah, let, let's try and go another route, shall we? I'll save the game right here, even though I've just ate through my health supplies. I'll save in that slot, so not to uh, overwrite one where I do have a reasonable amount of health supplies left. Prior to uh, just eating through them all. Yeah, let's go another way. Oh, what the fuck? When did I miss this? Uh, Lara? I was trying my best to climb up there, but <laughs> uh, she didn't like that key. No, she did not. Has it got anything to do with this? Oh god, it has. Right, okay. Hmm. I just ran around the entire ship. Okay. What's this? Uh... Huh. I need something to go in there now? Oh dear. I mean, where the fuck do I go to do that? Maybe that's... Turned off the electricity? No, of course it hasn't turned off the electricity. Why would inserting a nitrogen can in there turn off the electricity? Uh... Fuck. What do I do now, then? Hi. I can't really get through here, can I? No, but I need to get to the other side. Did the chef get back up and repair this? So that's the last damn intruder I'm having in my kitchen. I'll take these masses into my own hands. Fuck the engineer. Ah, right, 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 right. Fucking hell. God, this was a bit difficult. I think. I hope. 
I'm getting ahead oh no, I'm not getting ahead of myself. I'm definitely not getting ahead of myself. God, I've done so much to try and figure out what to do. <laughs> Fuck. God, that, that felt rewarding though, actually finding that. That was a bit difficult. I did not think to look, you know, above myself. I thought it'd be more obvious than that. Uh, it looks like this is actually a dead end. It is, yes. Okay, let's go the other way then. I'm guessing we're going to find the electricity to supply- Ugh. The electric- <laughs> Sorry. The electricity supply uh, through here. I don't know why I've got the gills today. Uh, you'll have to excuse me. Maybe it's the heat. It's kind of getting to me. Um, yeah, let, let's, let's just go through this way. Oh, God, it is really hot. Like, I, I'm slowly stripping off as I'm playing this. Yes, slowly stripping off as I'm playing Tomb Raider Chronicles with just one hand. Hmm. If you hear any dodgy sounds, you, 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 you know what it is. You, you know exactly what it is. It's me fanning myself off, of course, because it's so hot. My God, it is really hot. Um, what, what are we doing in this room? I mean, like, yeah, I don't see that much. Can we maybe do something with the shelf? The shelf? Yeah, the shelf. Come on. Unveil your secrets. Okay, you have no secrets. Hooray! Let's double inspect it because uh, I think I saw something just up there a second ago, but I've turned around and I can't loot back now because I'm stuck checking this shelf. Yep, yeah, um, there we go. <laughs> I need you so badly right now. Pull that lever. There we go. Oh, it's darker. It's darker. I can't fucking see anything. Oh, good lord. Sorry if I'm getting further away from the microphone, it's because I'm trying to get a, like, an upscaled angle. So that I can actually see the fucking game, because it's, it's so bloody dark at the moment. Can I open this? Apparently not, even though it's one of the keyholes, right? Can I no. not? Yeah. <laughs> okay, we will go another way, and we need to find the, um... We need to go get the gold rose, don't we? By god, it is pitch black. I'm gonna find Vin Diesel, maybe. I'd like Vin Diesel right now. Uh, yeah, let's climb up this way. I'm sorry to see you guys who have a dog monitor. You're gonna be in heaven right now. Uh, at least we can see through here, because for some reason this has some sort of night natural lighting source, I guess. Though around the corner there is something kind of flickering away. Actually, no, it seems to be inside the wall. Should we do the fancy flip thing? How do you do that? Oh, there we go. Ta-da! Amazing. Didn't kill myself this time as well. Makes it even sweeter. Right. Uh, yeah, we're gonna head down to the kitchen, get that gold rose, and then we're gonna keep looking. Actually, on second thoughts, there's a whole bunch of other items we could be getting here, and we definitely need them. So you, get inside me. Uh, what else we got? Nope, nothing there. What about around the corner? I thought there was some other items in here for certain. Yes, what's this? Some magnum bullets, I believe? Is this actually a magnum? I get a lot of complaints for misnaming guns. Uh, well, not really complaints, just people finding humorous that I do not have a fucking clue what I'm talking about when it comes to guns. I do not know guns. Uh, looking at the texture of this, by the way, you know I mentioned before that it looks really, really bad. I think they flat out reused the texture from Tomb Raider 1. Like, that that's my only explanation for it, because we haven't really seen the Desert Eagle since, like... Uh, was it in Tomb Raider 2? Maybe, maybe in Tomb Raider 3, actually, I don't know, but yeah, they've definitely reused the texture from another game. That's for sure. Right, let's, um, let's inspect the other areas where there was, um you know, electrical cables. Now, of course, the obvious one to go down would be um, this one to the right of us over here, because we didn't go down there before, though now I'm starting to think that might be just the other side of the area that we were in before. Um, yeah, let's let's reinspect everything anyway. Hooray, the fires are still there. Ooh. Well, I can happily run around here now, I guess. Uh, no point in going in the toilet. I don't know why I'm so drawn to it all the time. There's never a point in going to the toilet. Well, aside the obvious. Um, yeah, let's head into here. I'm assuming we're not supposed to be around this area now based on the fact there is actually a gold rose in here. What the fuck? Sorry, the sound really confused me there because it, sound, it sounded like it kind of merged itself with the um, bizarre sounds that the submarine is making. 
Uh, don't think there was any other areas that there was any point in re-inspecting. Right? Not back here. Mm, no. Right, let's save the game once more here so we don't have to run back should we die. Um, though I really doubt that's gonna happen. No, we're pretty safe here, aren't we? Okay, let's use the silver key then. I'm assuming that our other two gold roses are going to be around this area, though that's kind of assuming that there is two more left. Let's have a look. Oh, no, it looks like there's only one, actually. Okay, well, uh, we may be on to finding it around here because, you know, what with the first one being in the, um... The first area of the game, or the level, sorry. Um, I would assume... The second one would be maybe in one of these lockers or something like that. I don't know. Let's inspect them all though, shall we? Uh, nothing in door number one, I guess. Let's hop over in this direction. Nice, that is what I intended to do. That perfect bounce to land perfectly in line with that. Ooh, a first aid kit. Small one. Right, let's... um hop over in this direction, shall we, and inspect these two over here. I'm guessing we're going to find one of the key items over in here as well. But I would hope that we find a gold rose as well. No, no gold rose. Okay, right. Key item. <laughs> Otherwise, I don't know what we're doing here because this room seems pretty empty. Though, maybe it hides some sort of secret somewhere, I don't know. Ah, uh, right, okay, so that's the other item that we needed to get the fuck out of here. What else is there in here? There must be something. There must be something hidden. I wish I could see better. Hmm. Uh, let's have a quick run around the outskirts, firing like a maniac, so that we can actually see properly. No, nothing there. Uh, anything on the roof? Nope. Nothing associated to the roof by the looks of it. Why do I hear running water aside from the fact that the um, submarine is currently flooding? Okay, that is the sound that it is producing. Sorry, I'm not used to this dynamic sound thing. It's weird. What, what the fuck is this thing? Oh, wait, there's two of them. Maybe it's some sort of banner or something. Could be. Uh, right, okay, never mind. Let's, let's go and pop in the other item. Maybe, um, what? Oh, okay, wow. Two of them. Aren't we being adventurous today? That's one down. Yeah, can't handle those skills, can you? What's this? Item here. And another key. Wait, 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 wait. Where's this other key? Shit. Fuck, where, where, was, where was it? Where was that? Uh, I can't remember. Fuck. Um, hmm. Oh, snap. Got it. I know, I know, I know where it is. I know where it is. I think, I think it's up here. I'm not seeing shit, there we go, right. Now open that. Maybe this is this is our last gold rose. I don't know though. Um, hmm. Well, okay. Where where is this? We can't get out of here as well. Is there any roots about? Maybe maybe we'll find something in here. Come on, come on. Don't let us down. Yes. Fuck yes. Ooh. Okay. I'm on a roll today. Uh, this has been a bit of a tough level overall, but yeah, not uh, tough by this game's standards anyway. But yeah, managed it. I've done it, guys. Are you proud of me? Of course you are. You're always proud of me. You never comment that you're proud of me, but I like to live under the illusion that you guys do praise me a lot and say, <laughs> Alonzo, you're very good at this game. You've gotten very good at Tomb Raider over the years and, you know, Someday, someday that may change, you know, and it may become a reality. Uh, still unconscious, potentially dead, unsure. Let's climb up and pop in. I'm guessing the oxygen supply. Uh, green, oxygen, right? 
Because it's, it's, it's green gas. I don't know. Oh, it doesn't make any, doesn't make any sense. I got hiccups. <laughs> Excuse me. Oh, no, he's back. Yet, no time. The hull is breached, and we will drown soon. With the oxygen, you escape now. Not without you. I am Admiral Yarovev of the Russian Imperial Navy. I have served my great country for many years, but the country I know withers. The bear lies down to sleep for its final time, and I wish also this fate on the ship. You I keep snorting. No deal. Yes, deal. For the outer airlock can only be opened from inside the ship. This is my gift to your child. I release you to a future beyond this dying vessel. And my gift to you? Tell my story. Tell how the proud men of the Russian Navy fought against the enemy from inside and sacrifice their lives for that their country may once again stand proud. You have my word. I salute you. Quickly, into the airlock, and I will release you. So, he is a Russian... Asian. Okay. Goodbye, Admiral. Uh... A bit of a bizarre concept, but I suppose you can have any ethnicity of any country, so yeah. This is 2017 after all. I just want to make a point that these um, cutscenes are always in 25 FPS. Now I get that this was made in England, but it's a bit of a bizarre concept really. Rest in peace, I guess. Rest in peace. So what exactly happened to the other guy? I'm a little bit unclear on that. Lara saw enough of the power of this artifact to recognize its rightful place was where man could never again misuse it. And not enough for it to destroy her. Some powers are beyond the wit of man. Oh dear, gentlemen. I do apologize. It seems someone up above has a sense of humor. If you will excuse me a moment. I shall fetch candles. It is a night spurred by hell. And as the horsemen drove ever onwards across the world, the heavens boiled in their wake. Ah, benefits of a religious education. This night reminds me of the time out of Canusi. Winston's home? Indeed, yes. The staff had taken leave due to flooding. Lara, back when she was a slip of a girl, was staying with Winston and his wife. It was her that contacted me, as a matter of fact. Some trouble out on one of the islands. Weird lights, manifestations, that sort of thing. I just realized the priest is Irish. Thought I might be able to help. It was on a hellish night like this when I arrived. Stereotypes. Stereotypes. Just stereotypes every fucking way. Young Laura. Definitely young Laura. Evening, Winston. And how would I be able to help? So, people have seen these apparitions out on the island. There is talk of little else in the village, Bram. I'm doing all I can to keep this gossip from Lara. I, you would be a wise man. It would be unwise for her curiosity to draw her to that place. And you have some idea of what it could be? To be frank with you, no. But as the devil finds work for idle hands, I've spoken with Father Finnegan and have a boat chartered for the crossing late on this very evening. Good Lord, Bram. You have not chosen the evening for it. I have my faith to protect me, Winston. Be careful. I fear on that island it's what you cannot see that will hurt you, Bram. Time to get to the bottom of this, old friend. Bye-bye. Oh, Laura's gone with him. She's a stowaway. Of course. Ok, 
Okay, so where exactly is this next segment set? Hmm. Oh. Oh, I'm liking this. A bit of out in the open. Makes a change. Oh, wow. That's pretty nice as well. But, 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 guys. I'm gonna save the game right now. What, what levels are- oh shit, I just saved over the wrong thing. Gallows Tree. Because, I'm afraid that's all for this session. However, hold that comment. Hold that comment saying, Alonzo, what the fuck are you doing? Give me more Tomb Raider. Because, because, what I thought I'd do is, um, I've got another series going on at the moment, Resident Evil Outbreak, it's a continued series that, you know, I, I'm polishing off from many, many years ago. I decided I'm gonna do about three parts of that, four parts of that, marathon it, finish it all off, because it is in its, its final few parts. And then I thought what I would do after we finish that, next week I thought we will marathon Tomb Raider Chronicles. We will we will do the whole of this segment, whatever it is, all in one big chunk. Um, hopefully no interruptions, but there may be a few just for streaming and stuff like that, but yeah. And then we'll see how that goes and we might marathon the next segment. But, 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 guys, there's a catch. There's a catch. First off, this video has to get at least a million likes, okay? So, yeah. I'm holding it ransom until... Yeah, this video has a million likes, so hopefully that should be achieved by roughly 2030, 2040, I don't know, but yeah. I hope you've enjoyed this part. I know I most certainly have myself. That was actually a fantastic level, um, generally, you know, in terms of Tomb Raider. Again, it was a bit short, but ignoring that, the story for that segment was great. Um, the gameplay was pretty okay. You know, it felt like... If I if I put the entire segment together as a level or something like that, definitely feels like a classic Tomb Raider level, like Tomb Raider 2 or something. But yeah, that, that that's the whole segment in one go as opposed to all the individual levels feels like maybe one level of Tomb Raider 2 or something. You know, God, I'm really not giving myself to, time to breathe here, am I? Okay, so I hope you're looking forward to the marathon next week. I'll see you for that, guys. Don't forget the million likes. Definitely have to be in there before then. Otherwise, no Tomb Raider ever again, guys. That's it. That's it. No more Tomb Raider. Yep. <sighs>